To connect Streamline to QuickBooks, I will need to download and install the QuickBooks Foundation Classes Library. I can find it in the QuickBooks article of Streamline's documentation. Once that's done, the next step is connecting a particular company file to Streamline. First, I open QuickBooks. I open the company file I want to work with as the administrator. And I keep it open. Second, I open Streamline, go to Select a new QuickBooks connection, and open the file I've got opened in QuickBooks. In the dialog here, I select the start date and the group by period. The start date is recommended to be at least 24 months back, with as much sales data provided. The group by parameter lets you choose the period of aggregation for the imported data. I can also combine locations, merging them all into one. This function is useful in case your warehouses are located next to each other and you want to treat them as one warehouse. Although this function is only available for the QuickBooks versions with the Advanced Inventory module. Import Customers as Channels allows you to see and plan your demand by customer in addition to the item and location dimensions. And I click OK. In the Authorizations dialog that pops up next in QuickBooks, we suggest selecting the Yes Always option for smooth functioning. Click Continue and click Done in the next pop-up. That's it. Streamline generates the project and we can work with it now.